definitely feel the excitement in the crowd, um, or at least just yeah, the Australian public just talking to mates, talking to family. They're all pretty pretty excited for it, and they'll be coming down and cheering on. And Ashes is normally a stage where there's one or two guys that you don't think about who um, who really step up and, and take the series. Our conditions, we know I'm better than anyone, so it should it should mean that we're able to score the runs that we need to. I think our top. Top four are pretty strong. It's that middle all-rounder that we kind of struggle, but I think if our fast bowlers are fit and raring to go, we're going to be very tough to beat here on Australian soil. I think it'll be a good series, but I think Australia will win. And I think as long as our batsmen bat well in our home conditions, which I think they will, I think we've got the attack to really expose the England batting lineup in our home conditions. Look, for England to come over here and win is, is going to be incredibly difficult. There's, there's no question it always is to be able to win away from away from home. Uh, this is something you, you grow up uh, wanting to play. You emulate all the Australian players in the backyard pretending to play the Ashes, beating the Poms all the time. The men's Ashes I think will be a, a really interesting contest. I think I still think Australia will win, hopefully 5-0, but um, well, for Mitch's sake anyway, hopefully 5-0. You've kind of got to say 5-0, don't you? But um, there might be a washout, so they might get away with 4-0. To walk out there uh, at the Gabba on the first test is going to be pretty amazing and something I've really been looking forward to.